HubSpot meeting links, but you want to invite more than one person to the meeting? Well, now there's an option at HubSpot to do just that. We'll show you how in this video. Welcome to HubSpot Hacks, where we help you get more out of HubSpot. HubSpot meetings are a great way to take away the back and forth that typically happens when you're trying to find a time to meet. Whether that's over email or maybe on the website where someone's booking a sales demo, now you can have multiple people come to that meeting as a result of that meeting link. Let's dive in and show you how to do that right here in HubSpot. So you're gonna find that actually here in the sales tools and you're gonna drop this down to meetings. And once you're in the meetings area, let's actually show you how to do this from the top with a new scheduling page. So I'm gonna pull this up, we're gonna go one-on-one -on -one, and for the sake of this demo, we're just gonna go sales demo. And that's gonna be the event. We have another uh, video about how to actually set up your meeting links and go through all the things. But for here, I'm just gonna do this so you can show what this looks like. We're gonna make sure that this is Zoom. We're gonna choose a meeting type uh, as a discovery meeting, and then we're gonna click on next. Now this next is where we're gonna see the scheduling page and that specific piece that I talked about with adding people. So here we've got this form. Now when you click on form, you'll notice below we've got this allow guests. And if you toggle this on, this gives you a chance to add guests. So actually toggle this off and watch what happens on the right hand side of the screen. So before this is what our uh, form looked like when we're booking a meeting. So again, this is your prospect or your client or whoever's requesting a meeting. And then if I click on the allow guests, you'll notice that it adds this add guests area and you can add it to 10 guests on your meeting link. So we're gonna go ahead and again, best practices in setting up this meeting link. You do a lot of the other customization, but for the purposes of this demo, we're gonna go ahead and click on next. So we're going to click on that scheduling page. The one that I just created down here is called sales demo. If we actually look at this in a browser, you'll notice that it, this is, again, it shows my picture, my gravatar. This is the title that I chose. And then if I choose 215, you'll notice that I can add guests here. So let's say that I was going to add Tyler on my team and it simply says, okay, that's, that's added. I'm gonna put my name in here and then an email address and I'm going to click on confirm. So now when that happens, I get a notification here that we are booked, but then also myself and Tyler will get that notification as well. So let's go back real quick to the meetings area as well. So let's say that you have a previous meeting link and you want to toggle this on for that. Very easy here, click on edit, go to your scheduling tab, click on the form and simply allow guests on that there. So even if you have a previous meeting link or you're creating a new one, you can toggle this on and off as you wish. And again, up to 10 people can be added to that on the prospect end. So real quick pro tip, if you are using this and you're using it for let's say sales demos, good language to accompany this might be when you send out this meeting link, for instance, let's pretend that this is a sales demo scheduling with one of your prospective clients. So, hey, prospective client, here's my meeting link. And actually this is set up so that you can add anybody else that you need on the demo with you right there on the scheduling link. Simply click add guests, enter the email addresses, and we'll all be on the same meeting invite. Again, that's super convenient if you happen to need someone's boss or a VP on the call together so you can get the maximum buy-in for your sales opportunity. And that's it. For more tips, tricks, and how-tos, hit that subscribe button, and we will see you next week.